Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Angelica Bonilla with the Bonilla Group and Excellence Real Estate in the HD. So um, I get asked a lot, what are one of the best uh, school districts out here in the high desert? Okay, so that's what we're going to be talking about in this video is uh, about one of the best school districts up here in the high desert. So if that's what you're wanting to know, uh, keep on, um, stay on and keep watching because that's what we're going to be talking about in this video, okay? I also wanted to talk to you about, um, um, I know that you guys know that I'm recovering uh, from COVID that I got um, starting in January uh, 2022. So I'm still recovering from that, but um, I just wanted um, to tell you that I'm gonna be doing a lot of my videos now, or not now, but you're gonna be seeing me more with um, me using um, my oxygen actually, okay? Because um, it's a part of my recovery and um, I was taking off, taking off the, the oxygen just to uh, uh, work on my videos. And also it helps me, it's like a therapy, right? Uh, to get me used to not having to depend on having uh, the oxygen on. But um, I'm going to be using a, a different camera. So I'm not going to be editing my video that much. I'm going to try not to edit my videos that much so I can go ahead and I can upload them faster. Um, so I hope that you guys don't mind, but uh, this is kind of what I'm going through right now. It's part of my recovery and my healing. Uh, but I still want to give you all of the information that I know that you guys need to make a better decision when it comes to moving up to the high desert of California, okay? So let me get back to my video, okay? So I get asked all the time, Angelica, what are what's one of the, the best school system or the best uh, school that um, is out here in the high desert? Where are they? Where are they located? Okay, so I'm going to be talking to you about an area here in the high desert. And it's going to be, I'm going to be talking to you about the school district. And uh, there's a couple of schools in there, but you're also going to see the difference in affordability. Okay. Because uh, the home prices are not that affordable in those areas. I mean, they're they're more affordable than LA, of course, or Riverside or Rancho Cucamonga or Redlands. But uh, meaning if you're gonna move uh, up to the high desert to Victorville area, Asperia, Finland, Oak Hills, you're looking to, to stay at a more reasonable uh, price rate, price range, I'm sorry. Okay, so that's what I'm talking about, okay? so. Let's go, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna show you and talk to you. We're gonna go over some reviews. We're gonna go over like the schools. I'm gonna show you the map of where the school district is located. And uh, so you could take, a, you can actually see where it, it's located, where it's at, and what are the names of the schools that are associated with that school district? Cause I haven't seen anybody, well, really I'm, kind of the only one really talking about all the school districts and all that stuff. But um, of course, like always, I have to tell you, I'm just giving you information. I'm giving you public records, public information. You can find this on Google, niche.com, on greatschools.com. Okay, I'm just um, going ahead and I'm uh, giving you the information. Okay, it's up to you to verify all of the information and look into each area and look into each schools because in the end of the day I don't live in the that area 
Um, so you're going to have to go and, and see the area, look at the area, visit the schools if you like, and read all the reviews online. And we're going to go through a review of uh, the school. Okay, so... Okay, so where's that picture up? Hold on. Okay, so this is it, okay? So uh, this is the, the school system that we're gonna be talking about. So it's called uh, Snow Line School District, okay? It's um, located, well, the school district, the actual school district, the office is located in Finland, California. Okay, but if you see this video here, um, video, the map here, sorry. If you see the map here, it kind of lets you know where it's located. Okay, so if you're coming up the Cajon Pass on the 15th, okay, you can exit uh, 395. This is 395 right here on the 15th freeway. 395, and then this is Palmdale. Okay, this is Palmdale Boulevard. So the this area, or these the school district, is in this area, and also the 138. Okay, so Heritage has an A minus. This is Wrightwood Elementary School. Pinion Hills Elementary School. Serrano High School is one of the school in the this area. That's Serrano again. Be patient with me, please, guys. Uh, Finland Elementary School. Quail Valley Middle School. Okay, so uh, Bradley Mesa Elementary School. Okay, so I was looking into this area and um, it's close to Oak Hills, Bradley Mesa, uh, Sunset Ridge. Hold on. Okay. This is what I wanted to show you because I was talking about like home um, affordability. Okay, for this, this school district that we're talking about, the Snow Line uh, School District. Okay, so this is a four bedroom, three bath in Finland, and it's 595. Okay, look at this one four bedroom, four bath, 689 in Oak Hills. This property here in uh, Pinion Hills, 425, four bedrooms, two baths. Uh, this property here in Finland, $554. So it, it I mean, it's a, um, they're low prices, but it's not at a, as affordable as uh, maybe uh, Victorville, Apple Valley, or Adelanto. I know Adelanto, but <laughs> uh, you know what I mean, okay? Okay, I'm gonna, let's uh, see. 
let's see the actual, um, let's, let's read a review together. I think a student left, left, left this review. Uh, Serrano has an Im impressive amount of clubs for students to join. For the, the most part, teachers care about their students and everyone gets along. I attended Serrano for all four years of my high school education. Many of the students are excited to go to class and learn. The AP teachers are well qualified for their jobs and do an excellent job at engaging their students and attention. Mm -hmm. Everyone is friendly, including the counselors. They're very helpful in re registering for classes or when you need a place to run to when you're too stressed out to go to class. Oh. The only problem with the school are that it's messy throughout the campus, but this doesn't really affect the learning environment. There you go. And this was, um, she's a, she was a senior and she left that. That's, that's cool. So clubs and activities, they gave um, Serrano High School a C. Um, it, it, it looks like it has a, overall that's, um, they have a good, it has a good rating. Okay. It has a B plus. Hmm. That's, that's um, better than a lot of the other the schools um, here in, uh, in the high desert, okay? Let me, let me, yeah, so I, I wanted to um, talk about uh, sh the Snowline School District because there's really no information about it. Um, about the, the school district, of the location, um, nothing. And that's why, for me, I, I was like, wow, okay, so nobody's really um, giving this information about where the school district is located. So, mm -hmm. all right, so let's go back to the map. Let's go back to the map so we could talk about the location and then the, the neighbor, different neighborhoods that are in the location. Okay. Okay. Oh. Okay.
All right. Okay, so let's talk about the location of the of where the school system or the school district is. Sorry, the school district. Ah, I'm sorry. So on the 15 freeway, okay, as you can see in this, oh, so like I said, the 15 freeway, 395 and Palmdale Boulevard, and also the 138. Okay, the 138 right here. So I hope I hope that you enjoy uh, learning about this uh, school district, uh, Shoreline School District. Uh, let me know what you think about the video. Go ahead, leave me a comment. Don't forget to like and don't forget to share uh, this video to anybody that you think needs to know or uh, if they're planning on relocating up to the high desert. Thank you so much for wa watching. Angelica Unia.